Okay, the pistol offense. Seeing as how I haven't had an original idea since probably sometime in the 90s, I saw BYU, uh, their men's team, run this in the NCAA tournament several years ago when they played in Dayton. They played against the Manhattan University, I believe, and I saw BYU running this as their transition offense, and it was very, very simple, but it was hard to guard, um, cause the defenses to put themselves in tough situations. So, of course, I decided to, we'll just say, borrow this. Um, there's a lot of different ways to run pistol, but basically it's a dribble handoff followed up by a ball screen, and the offense just kind of continues from there. The goal is to have the def have the defender have to guard two actions in a row, so to maneuver through a handoff, then a ball screen. You get a lot of switches on it, a lot of drives, a lot of driving kicks, and we'll go over some of what you're going to get out of the offense. So to start, this was my AAU team from a few years ago, and every single one of these players um, is either still playing in college or at least signed to play in college. Um, so this was a pretty... Pretty fun team to coach. So here's the idea. You've got your post player here in the middle on the nail. You've got guards on the weak side in the slot in the corner. And your two guards here. So we're going to do a dribble handoff. This player should ideally be dribbling at this defender. And then we're going to get the handoff. We're going to follow that up immediately with a ball screen. Uh, this causes a lot of defensive switching. Sometimes a lot of confusion. And we'll go over some of the reads here as we continue through the video. So again, wide open shot, don't get anything, but these are the kind of actions that you're going to get. So here we go again. This is pistol. Handoff, screen, we get a switch. Now this player is going to roll. Sometimes this is open. We have a throwback option here where we can swing it to this side of the floor and run the action on this side. But we get a switch, and this guard sees this. You got a big, she's sagging off, leaving a wide open three. Again, handoff, ball screen, switch, open three. Down for a rebound and a putback. It's nice if you have a mobile post as your screen and roller. And this player here in particular, um, she's got really good size, but she had really good feet and could move. She was very good in this offense. Here we go again, screen. This player here was completely lost, so our guard just took it right at the post player and got through. We'll run this through again. Same action. Screen, split, score. Move it to this side. Same thing on this side. Guard to guard pass, handoff, ball screen. Don't have anything, throw back and post up. Now here's some other reads coming out of it. Sometimes you can hit the roller, which we get right here. This was a fun game. Now let's, let's, let's back this up. This is another read. Any time that we're overplayed like this, we should be cutting back door. We looked at it, didn't like it. This guard does a great job of keeping her dribble. We'll use a screen on this side, then just keep running it. Now there it is again, overplay. This was a great read by both of these players. Overplay, backdoor. Get this a lot, draw a foul. Okay, now here is our team from this year running it. This was a young team. Um, so you, it probably won't be as crisp as what you saw earlier. But same ideas. Back door. Draw a foul. Overplay, back door. Sort of the story of our season, just not being able to not being able to quite finish. Handoff, ball screen. And as you can see, we like this big double gap right here. This player is going to roll hard. And we have options here pretty good shooter. We don't necessarily like the 
contested elbow shot. I mean, I'd much rather have this pass go here, but uh, she's a pretty confident shooter. She knocks it down. All right, running it back, handoff. See how we're a little bit slow on this? I would like this to be a lot faster. We should get it and be immediately attacking and not necessarily waiting. There's our throwback. Now, this player is not a big threat in the post to score. So I'd much rather have the, the pistol action and then swing it to this side of the floor. We come back at any time it gets back here, this player can come up and set a screen, and now we're just in spread ball screen formation. And that's the kick. Again, young team. This is a very good option. This player has, has overcommitted the help. Now, the pass here, that's an uncontested three. This is a young player. She catches it and just fires it. Kind of, kind of a contested shot. One more pass would have been wide open. DHO, ball screen. Nice job. There's the throwback. Don't have it. Get it to this side of the floor. Same action over here. This is a great decision here, and we, we really encourage you doing this. The post player is high because she's, she knows she's coming to set this ball screen after the handoff, which sometimes leaves this wide open. Anytime this player sees that gap, just go. Great play. DHO again. Again, we wait a little bit. We should probably get going a little more. Now let's, let's rewind this one. This is another option that we allow the guards to do. Um, it can be very effective. We call this looping behind. So as she comes off of this screen, this guard is just reading what her defender's doing. And when she wants to go, just like this, she's going to go behind and get this handoff. She can pop for a three or she can drive. And this usually, look what this has done to the defense. We got three defenders here guarding basically two players. Our role player is running. This player sees this. And again, the story of our season Everything's executed well. We just don't quite finish. All right, here we go again. Hand off. Ball screen. Nice job on the roll. But again, anyone that runs pick and roll, teach your posts that when you catch this, go at the defender. Don't go away like this. That, that's going to make it tough. She got better as the season went on with that. Very good team that we're playing here. Okay. So now you're going to get this a lot by running this offense. So let's watch this again. We're moving with pretty good pace here. The ball's moving side to side. We get a pretty okay screen. This post player had a had a habit of this of, of just kind of tapping and rolling, almost like slipping every screen instead of holding it. But still, we have a nice double gap drive. But you'll get this right here is the pass. This right here. And then you, you're either driving a closeout, shooting a three, or one more to the corner. But we take arguably the worst shot in basketball. It goes in. She makes the shot. But this is about as low efficiency of a shot as you're going to get. Hand off ball screen. Much better screen. And look at the gap we have because of it. Driving in, drawing a foul. Handoff, ball screen, swing it other side. Very good so far. Setting it up. Good, great job. This is one of our go-to moves on this offense as well. So sometimes a few clips before we saw the guard split and go this way. One of my favorite things to do in this set is to, to actually fake this handoff and keep going. And again, just can't finish it, but it doesn't get much better than this. Fake it. They both react to it. Got to knock that in. Dribble handoff, ball screen. Now again, let's 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 back this up again. So we come off. We get that. She goes on, or she this this player here. If they hedge. When we swing it, we're going to get this player on the roll. But again, we're still 
kind of learning some of the reads here. So this should be an attack. This should be turn the corner, attack this player. She's a little wide here. She comes off. She should be going downhill in this direction, attacking that foot. Hand off screen. All right, here we go. This is, this is an interesting one. This is an interesting one. So we come down, got our hand off, and I any time that, that the guard goes under, if you've got shooters and they start going under, it's really, really tough to guard that. All right, this is later in the season. We're starting to get a little bit better at running this. So we're on we're in pistol, handoff, screen. Now let's watch let's watch this here again. I know we missed the shot, but later on in the season, we started to add a weak side interchange to this to where to occupy the help defenders a little bit more. So watch these two players over here as the DHO begins to happen. And watch what the defense does. It's a really simple action. We either will screen sometimes on this side or just interchange. And the defense is immediately lost. Great decision here by our guard to kick through the corner for an uncontested three. Hand off. Watch here. Here's, here's our interchange again. Occupying the help. And let's back that up again. Again, she's a good shooter. We get our handoff and our ball screen. This defender is lost, and she sees it, knocks it down. Well executed. Handoff, ball screen, swing it. Good job of the post getting out there, driving that gap. Very good. All right, we're in the slot. There's our handoff. There's our screen. Didn't get anything out of it. Nice job staying in the offense. Keep running it. Swing it to this side. And eventually someone's going to pop open. We need to run this with a little bit more pace. We're kind of moving a little bit slow right now. Moving the ball to one side, swinging it. But another good kick to the corner. That's open quite a bit. So basically what you're going to get out of this offense, if you've got four guards, you have some shooters, you're going to get open threes. You're going to get post rolls. You're also going to get, which we didn't see in this video, but one of the things that you will get out of this is when this post sets this screen and they swing it, if there's a hedge... If there's a hedge, when this player is rolling hard out of this, you get this nice little triangle pass where you swing it, and then that player, but see how she's sagging? Since she's sagging off of this, if this is a better screen, this player is going to be attacking this player. But it's not a great screen. She just slides over it. But if this player is hedging this screen, you're going to get this post player on this diagonal roll all day. But she's covered because of how she's guarding it. But you get that quite a bit. And eventually, you're going to get that double gap drive to where you're going to get into the lane, and then you're going to get kick out threes or, or kick out driving closeouts. But if you've got four guards that can shoot it a little bit and a post that can move, it's a, it's a very effective offense and very simple. And you can build a lot of things off of it. You can set flare screens off of it. This is a pretty rudimentary way to run it. But it is effective. Um, you know, as the defenses get better, you can add more things to it if you need to. So that's pistol.